We're holding steady here at 49 degrees at Cho, 37 in Charleston, 36 in Columbus, 25 in Indianapolis. So there's the cold weather. We'll get a taste of that as we go throughout the day Wednesday. And then I talked about the area of high pressure giving us a cold on Thursday over the Great Lakes today. Well, notice the temperatures in the Great Lakes. Low to middle teens right now. This slides into the northeast, drains down the eastern side of the Blue Ridge Mountains, and that's why we're looking so cold on Thursday. Couple that with the storm system still trying to develop here in the northern Gulf of Mexico. Once it does, it is going to lift up the eastern seaboard. Well, with moisture running into cold, that's the right recipe to get some wintry precipitation. But as far as the day ahead is concerned for your Wednesday, here's what our CBS 19 Weather Authority app. Remember, you can download it for free in your app store. We're looking at 35 degrees at 6 o'clock in the morning, 36 degrees as we head out the door around 8 o'clock. Lunchtime, we're generally in the middle 40s. Yeah, it's going to be on the chillier side on Wednesday with forecast highs only in the mid to upper 40s. But then for your Thursday, you'll want the app because things are going to be changing in a hurry. How are they changing? That purple color is ice. Yeah, we're looking at some sleet and freezing rain as we go throughout the day. Thursday morning, maybe mixing in with a little bit of snowflakes periodically at times. Thursday morning, but overall we're expecting mainly sleet on this side of the Blue Ridge Mountains. And that sleet continues. Notice all the way through Thursday morning. Now after lunchtime, that rain gets a little bit closer. So that means, yeah, we'll be dealing with a little bit of freezing rain as this transit transitions over to a just plain old fashioned cold rain later in the day on Thursday. So here's our latest thinking areas in pink, mainly sleets in the Blue Ridge Mountains. You'll be a little closer to that warm nose. In other words, a layer of warm air a few thousand feet above us as a result you'll be dealing with mainly freezing rain heading to Richmond Thursday. You may want to leave a little early to get a through central Virginia, but as you head towards Richmond, there'll be plain old fashioned rain. So here's the timeline in case I confused you a little bit. A little bit of snow can't be ruled out early in the morning, mainly before sunrise, but mainly sleet expected during the day on Thursday, especially in the morning and then around lunchtime. We'll slowly start to see that transition over to a plain old fashioned cold rain, and we'll be dealing with that cold rain most of the afternoon. But with sleet falling, and that means that freezing rain could still freeze on contact of some of those ice pellets. So we'll keep a very close eye on that. Madison Ford extended forecast here has temperatures only in the middle 30s throughout the day on Thursday. But at least we look to melt pretty quickly on Friday with forecast highs back in the low to middle 50s. Not only Friday, but also through the weekend and early next week. Another dry cold front arrives on Tuesday, sending temperatures back down into the 40s, but Thursday, that's a great time to download the CBS 19 Weather Authority app because probably going to get a good use out of it, especially with that wintry weather arriving. And things will be kind of in flux till we get real close, too. So Yeah, I mean, the difference of a degree or two makes the world of difference. Hopefully it's a degree warmer so we don't have to deal with the ice. Love that. Amen Thanks, David. That. All right, well, let's give some money away after.